Hey guys, Techno Metro with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone if you can't hear someone on the regular speaker, but you can hear them on your loudspeaker. So how do you fix this problem? Well, it's going to be a couple things you want to check out. So let's get started. So the very first thing to check out is that because the normal calls come through this audio, you want to make sure the top here is cleared. If it has a lot of dust or dirt buildup, it will not be able to kind of project that sound audio so you want to clean that up the speaker usually comes out here that's why the speaker might work if these are clear but then this is clogged so if you want to take something to kind of clear that out as well and after you have done that the next thing to do is go ahead into your setting of your iphone and for the bluetooth device you want to check if it's connected to another bluetooth device maybe your airpods car another speaker what will happen is the audio will get routed there so you won't hear anyone there so i recommend is turning off bluetooth and see if you can hear them on the call now with your regular uh, earpiece now if you do then you know of course the bluetooth connected device that is interfering with your call and you can either go ahead and select it to forget or disconnect that device as well and you can also do it from the top menu here and click on it it will show you it should look something like this now if it's bluetooth connected device it will also show up but if you press and hold it will tell you what device it's connected to so you want to disconnect from that device now the next thing you want to do in your settings is go into accessibility and this time under accessibility we want to go ahead into our touch option here and then the touch option here we're going to look at call audio routing and we're going to click on that we want to ensure that it's selected to automatic if it's selected to bluetooth or speaker right it will go to either of those so make sure that it's selected to be automatic not to either of those so it doesn't interfere again now another thing in the accessibility setting that we want to check out is going to be under audio visual so you're going to look for audio visual setting here on your iphone so let's go ahead into audio visual under hearing aid we're going to click on that and we want to share check out a couple things here first thing the balance should be at zero zero you don't want it to be left or right because it can also interfere with the audio settings so make sure it's at zero zero if you changed it in the past so you want to change that back as well for got accidentally changed as well so keep that on as well and besides that, you should now be able to hear your caller. Now, if you're still having issues with the calling, it's time to go ahead and do a forced restart on our iPhone. So in order to do a forced restart, we're going to quickly press and release the volume up, quickly release the volume down button, and then hold the side button until the screen goes completely black. So I'm going to do press and release the volume up, press and release the volume down quickly, and then I come over to this side and hold on to that side button. And I'm going to keep on pressing and holding till the screen goes black it's going to ask you to slide to power off but you don't have to do that just keep on holding that side button so it forces the phone to completely shut down and then it's going to reload the code once you see the apple logo up here you let go of that side button again make sure you press volume up and down quickly and you might have to do it a few times to get the hang of it so if you don't get it the first time just keep on trying volume up volume down and keep on pressing and holding that side button and this method is completely safe will not delete any of your personal data uh, like photos videos apps everything will still be on your phone now if you're still having the issue the next thing to do is go into your setting of your iphone go to general and then go all the way down here it says transfer reset iphone we we'll click on reset and we're going to do a network reset basically network reset resets things resets things around network like bluetooth connected devices and your wi-fi settings back to factory it will not delete any of your personal data so all of your photos videos apps will be safe but it's something necessary to do if you're still having issues with the with your iPhone calls not coming through still. Now the next thing you want to do if you're still having is just go into your setting of your phone, go to general, check if there's a software update because most of the time if there is a bug going around or issues, Apple will send an update out. You can update your phone, give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes to update your phone and make sure your phone is at least 50% or more charged while you're doing this. Now if you're still having an issue and you happen to have the iPhone 12 or the 12 Pro, there is a service program or recall for the earpiece and speaker of the iPhone which you can look it up if you go into Google and then just search up Apple service service program right you want to search this up basically the search uh, the service program or recalls and there's a recall for the iPhone 12 and the 12 Pro for no sound which you can check if you're eligible for a recall service which Apple might repair it for you for free or give you a new device and it lists which certain amount of or specific devices that are impacted you can read through that information as well on their website 
basically it's a way or possibly to get it fixed for free or get a replacement device and that's it for it i hope this video is helpful in resolving your sound issue on your iphone calls if so please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iphone and other ios devices see you guys next time